First, let's take a glimpse into clean transportation. Commuters often use cars to get from their homes to work. Carpooling is an easy way to reduce overall carbon emissions. Other ways to make transportation cleaner are walking, biking, and public transport. It's important that cities encourage and support all of these modes of transportation. Gosh, traffic is really bad. We might be late to class. Yeah. Hey, why don't you move over to the carpool lane? It looks like it's going a lot faster. That's a good catch. Wow, this is a lot better. Hey, thanks for driving, by the way. Yeah, of course. I love talking with you. Plus, it's easy to carpool. It saves money on repairs, gas, and less pollution. That's so true. That makes me think, why don't people carpool more? Water, vital to life, precious, yet all around us. Water makes up most of the land surface on Earth, yet only 1% of this water is drinkable. In California, there is a massive water shortage where dams and lakes have reached record lows in recent years. This mega drought is the worst in over a thousand years and conditions have been made worse by climate change. Governments must look into solutions for water insecurity, an issue that will only grow with time. Investing in ways to cleanse sewage water and placing policies to limit unnecessary water consumption is a good way to start. While governments do their part, we can do ours. In our own homes, we can save water by water your plants when it's not sunny out so the water doesn't evaporate. I guess that makes sense, yeah. yeah. Dude, turn off the water while you're brushing your teeth, you're wasting it. Oh my god, you're so right, dude. Like Oh, I can turn off the water while I'm conditioning my hair. <laughs> 